Hi folks, welcome to another episode of Tableau in two minutes. Today we're going to be going through, again, some of the basics of Tableau, looking at the different options for aggregating measures. Uh, now remember, a measure is a continuous field, so that's going to be a field that is uh, numbers, basically. Uh, and we can choose to do a number of different things to aggregate them. So if we wanted to go ahead and drag discount out to our rows shelf here, you'll see that the default option is sum. Sum just sums up all of the values in the data set. So if you imagine a big Excel table, it's the equivalent of putting a little cell at the bottom with equal sum and then the whole column. Uh, but we also have other options. Obviously, average just takes the average. So that's the sum divided by the count. Uh, median takes the median value. So that's going to be the value that is directly in the middle. Uh, count just gives us a count of all the rows. Um, you can see in this case, we have 994 rows in the data set. And then count distinct gives us a row of all the distinct values in the data set. So of those 9,994 uh, values in the data set, there are 12 different values um, for uh, discount. Now, that's one way of doing it. Let's go ahead and change this. The one that makes the most sense to me, at least, is, uh, is either average or median. So we'll go with average. Now, one of the things that we can do is obviously we can uh, take the uh, take each of the values and we can aggregate them within a function. So let's say we wanted to do uh, profit margin, right? So profit margin is going to be the sum of profit divided by the sum of sales. So let's go ahead and apply that. Now you'll note that we have the sum of profit and the sum of sales. So we've actually done this aggregation that we did with discount up here. Discount, we were able to change it on the pill, right? We could select our option. Um, but within uh, this, we've chosen to tell it specifically how to aggregate, chosen to tell Tableau specifically how to aggregate this particular field. So what's gonna happen is when we take profit margin and we drag it up next to um, discount on the shelf here, we have what's called ag. Ag means that it is aggregated within the function. So we're doing um, a, not a row level calculation. This is going to be uh, a an aggregate calculation. And we have told it specifically how we want to aggregate that field. And you'll see if we go into the submenus here, there's actually no options for us to aggregate it um, ourselves. Uh, so that is a basic walkthrough of some of the different aggregation options you have within Tableau. Uh, as always, there's a link to the data set and the workbook in the video description. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. And uh, if you like what you hear, and if you'd like more Tableau tips and tricks, then please subscribe to our channel, and we will see you next time.